exactly why Mitt Romney was there. He wasn't making an appeal to the students and the parents of the inner city. Romney was letting Republicans know he's committed to privatizing the education of young people in America and turning a profit on grade school students. It's all about the money. In his new education proposal, Romney promotes more direct funding, federal funding for charter schools, more digital education, and more state control over public education costs. We must provide families with abundant school choice among both traditional public schools and charter and online alternatives. Romney doesn't care if the class sizes are overcrowded. More students means more money to keep the schools in the black. Students are just another spot on the ledger, another number on the bottom line. It's the Romney family way. Get a load of this. Take the private equity firm Solomir Capital, for instance. Romney invested $10 million into Solomir. The firm's manager is Romney's son, Tag Romney. Solomir has an investment stake in TA Associates, which is the owner of several for-profit schools. How about that? Folks, it isn't about education. It's about making a dollar. Privatizing education takes care of a lot of Republican problems. Number one, it weakens and maybe kills the unions. It allows the funding cuts for public schools so governors can run wild with the budget and hurt kids. Most importantly, it increases the profit margins of people like Mitt Romney and his son. The education of future generations takes a back seat to all of this. For profit. Is that where we want to go in America? There are